Hi folks, this is Ali and it's the day following the new year. I did a little video for you guys last night, put it up online, and I got a bunch of questions about a few different things. One of the questions that came up was, I thought ESX was a two-file system. Well, is ESX really a two-file system? Let's examine this when we come back. Okay, so is ESX a two-file system or not? Well, the short answer is yes, but the long answer is no. Two, ESX is a modular system, which means that it basically gives you as its core a two-file system, but it gives you a chance to grow on it based on the canal anatomy that you're dealing with. So, for example, if you have a basic canal, you should be able to do that usually with two files. But if you have a more advanced canal anatomy, then you're going to need a couple of files in order to turn that advanced canal into a basic canal then from which you could basically complete with two files and of course there are the advanced square types of canals that require even more files so let's get out of this thinking that you need to only use one two or three files to do all your cases there's no such system that can address all cases with a given number of files you're going to have to get a canal to a given size and that could take a number of files depending on the difficulty level of that canal and then you could generally finish that kind of canal with a couple of files in an ideal world um, you would need as many files as it takes to do the job properly correct i mean that's what you want to do unfortunately there's cost of these things and people and companies have been marketing the number of files as a motivating factor for whatever system you're using uh, whether it's a single file system or one and a half file system or a 10 file system either way uh, ESX starts with a two file system as its basic which says basically that if you have a basic case you could complete that case with two files which is an expediter and then a finishing file so let's keep that in mind let's not get fooled by some of the marketing that you hear all you know from different uh, manufacturers and let's uh, stick to the concept of trying to instrument canals safely and efficiently and if we just do that we're going to do ourselves and our patients a lot of favors all right guys i'll see you in the next video